let's check this one out sometimes there's cars we get in no matter the year of the vehicle you know the age how long it's been around they just make us scratch our head because of the condition of them that's what this one is here's a 1993 pontiac sunbird se convertible and the way it's been cared for and the condition that it's in just amazing uh, a little over 14,000 miles on this a one owner vehicle um, a mature gal had this car she actually had a 1990 she traded that in on this 93 because she loved her 90 so so much she wanted a 93 uh, one of the more popular J bodies spanned two decades actually and uh, she wanted this car so she bought it brand new and uh, that is where we got it from was the original owner unfortunately her husband had passed away not real long after she'd got this car three four years I believe it was so she just didn't drive it as much but hung on to it uh, the way this car was stored when we went to pick it up she had a thick plastic covering on her cement garage floor and then on top of that had carpet laid which she parked this on top of that carpet if you want to know how to store a car take a look at the underside pics of this um, it is unbelievable um, the bottom of this thing looks practically like new uh, you're gonna see red how it was sprayed and that's funk from the factory this car hasn't been repainted it's got a clean Carfax there's no accidents indicated you take a look at the underside you'll see what I'm talking about now speaking of the underside and the pictures of the interior engine bay trunk uh, check the pictures out all at uniqueclassiccars.com down below this video in the description there's a link click on it that's gonna take you right there so you'll be able to check this car out uh, there'll be a description of it everything like that um, in those pictures you're also gonna find pictures of the original window sticker from when she ordered it um, you're gonna see a build sheet uh, there's the uh, locking lug for the wheels that would have came with this, still in the plastic bag in the glove box the owner's manual all the manuals that would have came with this she even saved the knockouts um, from the keys when she originally got them at the GM dealers uh, in the keys they had these knockouts with numbers on them they just came on this fine um, ring and when the dealers sold them put their dealership keychains on them they'd knock these little uh, how do you want to explain it little metal things where you're gonna put your key ring through you'll see what I'm saying you know what I'm talking about if you've never seen it before she saved those taped them to the uh, outside of the owner's manual I mean just just crazy the condition of this car wait till we start it up look underneath the hood and everything um, you look up and down the sides of this you just you don't see nicks scratches and dings um, when we get around to the front and I open the hood and and pop that I'll show you a couple that I found uh, where they've been touched up up in the hood so anything that it would have maybe gotten a little chip in the hood or whatever she's touched up take a look at the condition of these wheels um, where the Weights are, lots of times you get corrosion because the cars are driven out in the rain or in climate weather. No, there's no corrosion, even where those weights are. And just every time you look at something on this car, it's just crazy uh, how clean and nice it is. Now, this one also, as you can see on the side there, 3.1 liter V6, upgraded engine in it, three speed automatic transmission, upgraded transmission. And of course, power windows, power locks, uh, she did replace the stereo CD player down before because I'm guessing it was giving her problems they, they mounted a nice aftermarket did a nice quality job of it and I'll show you that when we get around to the other side but just look at how the seats have worn very very nicely they're not again full of grime or wear tear or anything like that uh, here's the boot now there is in the trunk the original CD player that they took out to put that aftermarket stereo in. Uh, there's also a duster for the car and then the bag that you would put the boot in is also in the trunk. And you can see the, those in the pictures as well as the interior of that trunk. Now remember we do consider trades. Financing is available. Of course we can assist you with getting this beauty to where you're located at. And it may be eligible for an extended service contract. Consult with your sales associate when you give us a call or email. Again, you come around to the back of this and just unbelievable condition. Some Prairie, that's where she lived, Wisconsin, not too far down the road from us. This obviously was her summer car when she did drive it. It has not been in, in any inclement weather. 
And again, you look at the underside of this, uh, you're gonna agree with me. Again, take of the wheels, look around the weight, just no corrosion. Tires have been exchanged since the original, and there is a folder full of receipts that she saved from oil changes and say like the battery and stuff that she had done to it. Now, of course, uh, ASC did the convertibles on these. Company that's still around to this day. Works with a lot of different car manufacturers for customization. I uh, wanted to show you what I was talking about here. Look at if I can get it to show up. I don't even know if you can even see that. There was one little touch up I noticed. And one other one little here. Must have got a little rock chip or what have you. Look at these headlights. You know how they get cloudy once they become so old or they're out in the sun? No, those headlights are like brand new. Wow, things like a time capsule. Wait till you see underneath the hood. All right, let's go ahead and check this interior out. You gotta see this too. All right, door panels. Lots of times if they're gonna get grime or worn up here, if they're gonna crack or age, it's here. Here's your original. GM floor mat that came with this car. Wow. Look at the seat. Now where you see it's a little bit darker, lots of times that's just the nap of the fabric, depending on what way it's laying, but you can see it's not worn, tore through there. And the gray interior, which you'll wear obviously if it was not properly cared for and taken care of or had a bunch of miles on it. Again, a little over 14,000 original miles. Gotta grab the keys. I think I left them in the trunk here a second. Nope. Do have them in here. All right, let's start this up a second. See how easily it starts? There's your miles, 14,426. The only warning indicator on there is the seatbelt light. So I have my seatbelt on. As you can see, all the gauges work. Tack is working. Again, there would have been the CD player here for the head unit up here. They've disconnected the head unit and just running off the CD player kind of way down there below. Take a look at the dash. No cracks, no wear. By the way, I have the AC on right here, just normal three quarters. It is blowing ice cold. AC works great. Power locks, power windows, all work. All right, what I'm gonna do is uh, pause this a second. I'm gonna pop this hood and I wanna show you the engine bay. All right, I'm gonna start with this hood liner. If you've lived in the Midwest at all, or you've had a car and you've driven it through salt, you'll know that this hood liner would have streaks, it would be white, it would be discolored. Just take a look at how clean that is. It's the underside of the hood in a car that's what, 27 years old? And look at this engine, babe. This gal definitely loved her Pontiac and she took care of it and it shows. So now let's find it a nice home. Somebody else is going to have some fun with it, take it out in the sun, enjoy it, drive it like she would want. 3.1 liter engine. Of course, power steering, power brakes. This car, of course, has ABS on it also. That AC blows cold. Look at the tops of these strut towers. Lots of times it's going to rust anywhere. We'll see, we'll see five, six, seven year old cars now starting to rust in the top of those truck towers. Wow. If you have any questions on this one, call us 507 386 1726. If you want to check out those still pictures, you have build sheet, uh, all the manuals, the window sticker, all the pictures can be seen at uniqueclassiccars.com. Down below this video in the description, there's a link. Click on it. That's going to take you right there. Uh, of course, we do consider trades. Financing is available. 
we can assist you with getting this car to where you're located at and it may be eligible for an extended service contract feel free to give us a call on this one you will not be disappointed